Hey everyone, it's me, Snowflake, your favorite YouTuber. We're not doing a YouTube video about doing stuff. It's story time with Miss Snowflake. So, today's story is called Autumn Gone Wild. And there's this cute little character called Autumn. She's our main character here. And she is a... No. We are going to figure out in the story. Let me just show you Autumn. This is our star of the story, the main character, Autumn. And this is the title, Autumn Gone Wild. Let me introduce the setting before we begin. A farm. And now, get your blankets and let's get cozy, because I'm about to start my story. my scarecrow. Her name is Autumn. Oh no! Not again! The scarecrow screamed. Ah! Do you want to know why Autumn screamed? The sweet scarecrow who lived in a big farm always used to stand for the whole day and the whole night to take care of the farm. She was very tired and bored of this routine. As days passed, fall season has arrived. The corn has been picked. The crows were gone too. Autumn felt lonely and sad. There, there was absolutely nothing for Autumn to do. But a mind-blowing idea popped in her mind. Taking a day off. She made a bucket list of things she always wanted to do. Now the plan was ready and Autumn was all set to enjoy. First. She went to the amusement park. She loved the rides and adventures there. Autumn really wanted to stay there longer, but she wanted to go to the next spot on the list. Domino's Pizza! For the first time in her life, she could taste the yummiest food. She kept eating and eating and eating until she burped. <laughs> hmm. What yummy food was that? She was so full that she couldn't even walk now. She checked the list and it was a mo and it was movie time. Wow! Whoa! Watching a movie was so much fun. As time was passing, Autumn was getting more tired and more happy. Let's see what happened next. The last thing on her bucket list. Swimming! <gasps> She went to the pool and jumped straight down. And guess what? She couldn't swim because she didn't know how to. Oh no! Poor Autumn. She started shouting for help and a small little boy came to help her. That's what Autumn remembered before she woke up and screamed. Oh no! Not again! As she found herself in the farm again. That uh, Autumn was sad that she was alone again, but she was very thankful, thrilled and happy that she could have a day off, full of fun. She kept waiting for the next one, the next year, with these lovely memories. Bye, I hope you like this story time with Miss Snowflake. The main idea of this story is how Autumn planned her day and had fun. So, you should always be thankful and grateful for what life gifts you. And also, look forward for more fun. Bye everyone!